Hey everybody, it is Nicole from Shape It Up Fitness, and I have not been on in a while, or at least it feels like I have not been on in a while doing a live video. This weekend has probably been the longest weekend in a long time. All good things. Um, so if you missed my last couple videos, they were on Saturday, and I did my 12th Goliathon. And if you are not familiar with Goliathon, it is a charity event that they put on two times a year, usually October and June, and it is for the charity Water, and or Water, sorry, Water if you're from Jersey, Water if you're from everywhere else. Um, but it is a great family-friendly obstacle course race that you can take your kids to, and it's a charity event. Again, I've done 12 of them so far. I haven't missed one yet. A um, lot of fun. We did that Saturday morning. Uh, and then I was busy running around taking my daughter to soccer all over New Jersey. Uh, all good stuff. But um, last night was kind of really cool. I had um, been on Facebook a couple weeks ago, and this ad popped up for a Carly Lloyd event. Now, I knew Carly Lloyd was a soccer player. I knew she was a good soccer player. I didn't realize she was the best soccer player, but um, I didn't really know much about her, and I decided to take my daughter. So basically, South Jersey Magazine was having an event, um, part of their Women Empowerment Series, and one of the events was having Carly Lloyd up as a panelist and um, just kind of asking her questions and hearing about her journey um, through soccer. So I signed my, I registered my daughter and I up for this and I wasn't sure how she would do with it because um, she's very, she's very into soccer. Um, she's very tomboy. She doesn't like to dress up or anything like that. Um, and so events like this, you know, where you have to kind of not necessarily eat with a fork, but you have to have some sort of manners. <laughs> Sometimes that can be challenging for her. Um, but so we went to the mansion in Voorhees uh, last night and we got to see Carly Lloyd. Again, this was a South Jersey Magazine event. Um, and again, I didn't really know much about Carly Lloyd. I know, I kind of live in a bubble. But so I didn't realize she is like the best female soccer player ever. Um, and we got front row seats to this uh, event. Um, I don't know how many people were there maybe 50 to 100, maybe 100, I don't even know. But um, we managed to get up in the front. Uh, I think most people thought they were reserved seats, but there were a couple that were not reserved. So my daughter and I jumped in them. Um, I mean, she was very close to us. Um, it was really kind of cool. It was almost like um, we were sitting at a family table where everyone was talking. So um, she, Carly Lloyd was being interviewed by one of the South Jersey Magazine um, uh, interviewees. Um, but she was really, like I said, I didn't know a lot about her, but she, I really, um, she's definitely got a, a fan from me. <laughs> My daughter loves her even more. Um, but she, I love her tenacity. I love that she just kind of gravitated into soccer and how she admits that she struggled a lot in the beginning like she had talent but she wasn't really using her full potential and how she kind of overcame that when she got a new coach and i love this coach his mindset you know um i want to follow him too because if you follow me you know that mindset is a big part of losing weight and i think that's the biggest missing component in a lot of programs. That is why I put it in my program because I don't think we realize how much our mind gets in our way. And we just think that the things that we say to ourselves are the truth and when in fact they really aren't. Um, so listening to Carly Lloyd talk, um, I really enjoyed the event. She uh, is a no nonsense type of lady. Um, and I didn't realize, I won't say how old she is, but I didn't realize that she was older than I thought she was. I thought she was in her 20s. Um, stunning lady. Love the fact that she um, got up there and told her story. And like, so I love the fact that she's a great soccer player, but I love the fact that she is an awesome role model to young girls. Uh, especially, like I said, I have a little, I have a tomboy girl, um, long blonde, flowing hair, beautiful child, tomboy as can be, likes to, you know, 
play soccer, does not like hair bows, does not like sequins or anything like that. Um, and I love that about her. Um, so it was nice to that Carly Lloyd expressed that she was also a tomboy and she just did her thing. And, you know, once she figured out that it was her brain stopping her from really becoming the best soccer player uh, on the planet, you know, she's unstoppable. I love, I just, I love the vibe that I got off of um, just even listening to her. So if you're just jumping in, my daughter and I went to the Carly Lloyd event um, at South Jersey Magazine um, up in Borges last night in New Jersey. It was so fun. It was so nice. It was really cool. Um, so now she has a new fan, me and my daughter. <laughs> uh, so that's what I wanted to share with you. Just the fact that like, I think even if you don't want to become the world's best soccer player, even if you don't want to become, um, you know, super fit, uh, like, like doing a fitness contest or something like that, even if you just want to go for a walk, um, or walk up three flights of steps without feeling out of breath. Like, I love how she was like, you know, you just be, you just be a better version of yourself each day. And that doesn't always encompass just fitness. It's, um, your relationships with your family. It's your relationship with your husband or wife. Um, it's relationships to your kids. It's, you know, all the stuff that we do each day. If we just focus on just being a little bit better, can you imagine all the things that we could accomplish. I mean, that's that's crazy when you really think about it. Um, but I really enjoyed the event. It was so much fun, and I'm glad my daughter had a great time because I wasn't sure wasn't sure how it was gonna go. But it was really cool. Um, she did do some Q and A questions at the end, which my daughter did ask a question. Um, me, mother of the year. I'm trying to videotape my daughter asking the question, and I realized I didn't hit video record. And then I went to turn to Carly Lloyd as she's answering it. And my, my daughter Mackenzie's like, Mom, you didn't push record. So I pushed record. I got Carly Lloyd's response. And I told my daughter, I said, we're going to have to reenact your, your question again <laughs> so we can get it on tape. Um, but it was a really cool event. She was really cool, uh, really nice. Again, just like an awesome role model because I feel like, you know, there's some there's some new generation people coming up that are considered role models for girls, especially. Um, in my opinion, there might be some questionable choices, you know, and I don't know about you if you have a daughter, but there are certain people that I don't want her to follow or emulate. Um, but Carly Lloyd, you got my thumbs up for being a role model for uh, my daughter, especially. So. Um, I have a ton of things coming up this month. I am going to try to jump on and do videos. If you have a request for something in particular, definitely put it in the comment section or message me. Um, I will be doing some videos on flying out to Texas for a psychology event, so I'm looking forward to that. And I got a couple other things in the pipeline that are coming this way, so make sure you stay tuned for Shape It Up. If you are interested in finding out why you're stuck not losing weight, oh, sorry, that's my alarm to go pick up my child. All right, so I'm gonna wrap this up. But if you are stuck trying to figure out what's not working for you, or if you're having trouble losing weight and it's just not coming off, or if you've lost it and you've gained it back and you just keep doing that yo-yo cycle, I wanna invite you to request a free phone consult with me. It's a 15 minute consult. Um, we're gonna talk about what is really blocking you from achieving what you say you wanna achieve. So if you're interested in that, I'm only gonna be offering this for a limited time. That is my plan. So um, definitely jump on there, schedule a call, and or you can message me, whichever is easier. All right, so get that done and I will see you soon. Remember to get fit, be fierce, and have no limits. I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.